about monogamy here for a minute. Are you afraid to miss out on the single life? Is that why you're really here? What? No. No, I just, I told you, I want to talk about... And there are just so many flavors that you're not going to get to experience. I understand if that would be unsettling. When you say flavors, that makes it sound... No more slut piles. No more slaughterhouses. No more different types of finger fun. Well, slut piles doesn't sound like anything I've ever participated in. Ever. Really? Okay. So you haven't actually lived the single life at all then. Which is worse. Because either you don't know what's out there and you're not interested, like a middle schooler, or you must be really tempted. No. First of all, I have done so much stuff. Like, I'm, I'm the man. And I don't get tempted because... Okay, sometimes I, I go to the gymnasium quite often and I see buttocks there a lot because it's Los Angeles. And sometimes I look and I'll notice. But I don't stress about that, right? Like, I, I shouldn't stress about it. It sounds like you're experiencing some vivid sexual fantasies. Care to share? No, I don't. I don't fantasize. I, like I was saying, there's no, there's no harm in, in looking. It's an instinct, really, you know, to look and look away. It's like looking at the sun, like it's a human function. And there are plenty of hot and oily and beefy dudes in Los Angeles that I'm sure my fiance takes notice of. I mean, she, she teaches yoga and spin with them. Oily and beefy. I know that. I heard it back. I don't know. I don't know why I said that. What I mean is that. What I mean is that there there are tons of of hunky as hell guys in this town that I see. I, I see them, and especially if it's in the locker room, I'll notice. And if if they have, I'll say, okay, I I want that on me. You know, not. Not on me, like if I could have it, that would be... Like, no, I wish I had that, that amount of, of, of girth. Don't write girth. My fiancé may look as well and notice, and that's all I'm saying is that that's fine, I'm totally fine with that. What are you writing down? What's that that you're writing there? Oh, it's just therapist shit. Continue. Okay, well, this is not something to be writing down. I was just trying to explain. What I'm trying to say is that you're still writing down. I, I'm an ass man. Write that down. I'm an ass man, and I always have been. I've always been an ass man. Ass man Joe, that's they call me. You can ask anybody. I love, I love ass so much in my face. Men have asses too, you know. I just want to make sure you understand that. Ha, uh, yeah, no. Weren't we, could we just please get back to talking about the wedding registry and how stressful it has been for me and my fiance? My female fiance. Write down girl because I'm already finished. Okay, yeah, now you're done writing. This is not.